morning guys it's currently like 5 35 today i'm going to be getting ready me for the first day of eighth grade oops not eighth grade today i'm going to be getting ready for the first day of freshman year of high school so ninth grade i slept terrible last night like i literally couldn't fall asleep because i was kind of nervous um and then my alarm went off so uh, i'm really tired but i have to get ready so let's go I'm going to start off by doing my skincare. I put this in the my skincare mini for last night and I'm so glad I did because it's really cool and it feels really nice. Okay, so now I'm gonna start my makeup. Um, I had talking points, but I already forgot them all. I'm gonna put this cat headband on. Um, I kind of got this one because last year I also wore one of these, and now I feel like it has to be a tradition. There. First thing I'm gonna be doing is going in with some sunscreen. But you guys recommended me to do this last year, and um, I'm listening to your guys' advice because I definitely should be wearing this every day. Just for a little time check, it is currently 5.51, so it did take me quite some time to do my skincare. Um, we'll have to rush a little bit of my makeup. My bus actually leaves at 6.55, which is an hour later than last year, which is kind of sad, but whatever. I'm going to be priming with these two products. I really like this pore stick. It's like really big. If anyone's wondering, ninth grade for me is the first year of high school, so I've already toured the high school. And it was kind of hard to find my classes because the uh, classes are kind of far apart. But I have a feeling that I'll be able to find them. They also gave me my schedule. I'll tell you that while I'm doing my foundation. My first period is math, and then I have algebra, then I have marketing, then I have health, biology, Spanish, and advisory, which I think is just like a homeroom. And I heard that it's only like something that happens on like Wednesdays or something like that. So yeah, those are the classes I chose. I'm taking algebra one, if anyone's wondering, and Spanish one. I'm a little nervous to see if, like how much harder the classes are, but I feel like it should be fine. I feel like I'll be able to do it, hopefully. Right now I'm just going in with like a skin tint type thing. I don't really, lately I haven't been in the mood to wear foundation because it just feels so cakey on me and then I think it's like either the way I'm like setting it or like my foundation, but like it just never seems to like you know, do you know what I mean? But like it just ends up feeling super cakey. But this thing is kind of nice because it's almost just like a like a light coverage type thing. But if you have any recommendations for like skin tints or foundations, let me know because I need some. <laughs> Next thing I'm gonna be using is concealer. This one's just from e.l.f. Also, when I toured the school, they already took my school photo. And um, they also gave me an ASB card, which I already lost. <laughs> that was literally like three days ago, maybe. And I already lost it. I'm so sorry. I just always lose stuff that's important. I do know some people in my classes. I have a couple classes with my friends from last year. Okay, my concealer is all blended now. I'm going to go in with this Glossier um, contour or bronzer, whatever this is called. Also, if you guys haven't already, you should watch my back to school videos. I did like a bunch of uh, like back to school hauls and then like I think I'm gonna post a back to school glow up soon if it's not already posted by the time this is out. But yeah, you guys should definitely watch my back to school themed videos if you want. To prepare for this, I also watched a bunch of get ready with me's for the first days. Those are really fun to watch. And my most viewed video is actually on get ready with me for eighth grade. It like kind of got a bunch of views over the summer and like the end of eighth grade, which I think is because um, people were going into eighth grade and they were searching for it. I don't really know, but yeah. Thank you for watching it. It's you know, contour blended. I've had past experiences with this contour where it's been really hard to blend out and you can literally see such a harsh line. Next I'm going in with this Milani blush. The time right now is also 6.03 so I think we're doing okay. 
Ooh. I forgot how pigmented this is. Here's the blush I'll blend it out. Next thing I'm gonna do is this e.l.f. Halo Glow Powder. If anyone's wondering how I'm feeling, I'm... Okay, um, well, I was not nervous, and then, like, the day started approaching quicker, and I was like, I'm not prepared. So, I'm nervous now. Last night, I literally could not sleep. I tried to go to bed at, like, 8.30, so I would get my, like, nine hours of sleep I'm supposed to get, <laughs> so I wouldn't literally be dead, and it did not work out like that. I fell asleep till, like, 12, and then could not fall asleep again. I literally stayed up till like 2 trying to fall asleep. Last night I was really nervous so that probably didn't help with me falling asleep. But right now I'm feeling pretty good. Also I feel like our school summer cut us kind of short because we got out kind of late and now we're starting a little early for us. We usually start after Labor Day and this year we're not. I was kind of breaking out if you can see like right here. But I think it covered it pretty well. Next thing I'm going to do on my brows. I just used these three products. I just used this for like a spoolie, this to fill them in, and this for like the gel. I don't know how I'm gonna wake up at 5.30 every day. Last year I woke up at 6.30, sometimes 6 if I like need extra time. So I honestly have no clue how I'm gonna do it. Now I'm gonna go in with brow gel. I'm gonna try not to put too much because my eyebrows will get sticky and like crunchy. I'm also gonna use the eyebrow pencil to do a little wing. My eye. There's a little wing turned out. Next thing I'm gonna be doing is highlight. This is from Merit. It's a really nice highlighter. I feel like this looks okay so far. Makeup always turns out bad when I'm stressed out. So I'm trying to be um, not stressed. I'm putting a little bit of this, oops, NYX um, jumbo stick and cottage cheese in the middle corner of my eyes. And then trying to blend it out with my fingers. That's what it looks like. Pretty good. I'm gonna do fake lashes today. I just do like the mini ones and I just put like two at the end of my eyelashes. And I feel like it makes it look like I have longer eyelashes. I'm going to curl my eyelashes. This eyelash curler rips out my eyelashes, but I have to curl my eyelashes. They're so straight, but like it also gives them a really nice curl. Like, look at that. So I curl my eyelashes. I'm going to apply the fake eyelashes off camera because I can never apply them on camera. I'll be back in a second. This took me literally forever to apply. Now I'm going to go in with telescopic. Next thing I'm going to be doing is lining my lip with this Milani lip liner. Then I'm going to go in with this gloss on top. This gloss is like plumping. It's really nice. Then I'm going to spray my face with this matte finishing spray. Now I'm going to be doing my hair. I think I have enough time to curl it. I think I'm just going to do like soft, like small curls at the end of my hair. In case you're wondering how I'm going to do my hair, this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it like this and then like curl the bottoms of it. I also washed my hair yesterday. It's literally steaming, but yeah, I'm going to do something like this. And I feel like if I do it all around my head, it will look cute. And then I'm going to do two little like braids in my hair. I'm starting to get more nervous. I'm actually not tired at all. Yesterday I chugged it. Ouch. Ooh, I just burned myself. Also, last year I did a you guys help me pick out my first day of school outfit. But this year, um, I filmed a TikTok in this one outfit. I don't know if you follow my TikTok, but you should. Um, this one outfit. And it got kind of a lot of views. And a lot of people said they really liked the outfit. So I thought I would wear it for the first day of school because I thought it was really cute. This is what my hair looks like so far. I'm going to go back and get a couple pieces of the back. Also, my curtain things are way too long to style now. They like are super grown out. So hopefully my curtain bangs will look okay today. Let's see if they'll style. If they don't, I can always just tuck them behind my hair. Here's what the hair looks like. I'm gonna get hairspray and two hair ties over it. Here's what the hair looks like. I think it looks really cute. I love the braids. I'm gonna change it to my outfit now, the outfit that I filmed my TikTok in, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. This is what the outfit looks like. I'm just wearing this New York top from Garage and these cargo pants from um, H&M. These are only like 18 bucks actually, so that's such a good deal. But, wait, sorry. I feel like my makeup looks so bad. I think we'll get a better look at them later, but 